Hello guys, how's it going? We're back with some more Valkyria Chronicles 4 for the PC. Chapter 1, the battle of Fort Crest, Siege of the Castle. Here are your orders. We're here to seize Fort Crest Howitzer. Squad E will lay siege to the castle and capture the enemy camp. However, turrets are guarding the entrance. If you wander into the machine gun's range, they'll cut through you like carving a cake. Concentrate on gaining a foothold instead. The plaza out front will do. But first, you need to get into place. Position units on the battlefield to do so. So, victory conditions. The enemy base camp is captured. Failure, the enemy occupies your base camp. All allied infantry fall in action or 20 turns pass. Uh, what's this? Reassigned squad. So, deployed members on the left and the extras are on the right. I think I could do equipment. Changing equipment. Change equipment by issuing combat gear to infantry and installing parts onto tanks. Customize the loadout of soldiers and vehicles to suit your strategy. Here we go. Bullets made with RMPC capabilities. 3 versus aim and 3 versus armor. Let's do that. Give it to him. Can I give it to her as well? No. You only got one. Okay. Tank parts. Anything I can do with that? Uh, oh, you can change the camo and decal. That's cool. Change the visuals of them. And you can change it. Oh, they actually give you stats. Decal gives me uh, plus three accuracy. That's cool. Uh, optional parts. Each optional part has a size associated with it, such as a uh, two by one. Vehicles have a limited amount of space, so keep part size and placement in mind. So it's just kind of like Tetris. We don't have any parts. So, yeah. Uh, I think we have enough reserve. Oh, there's an open slot. We'll put in another scout. Okay. Let's position our units now. Unit placement and leaders. Position units to choose which soldiers to deploy and where to place them. You use a D-pad to choose a camp to deploy units to. Confirm with A. Submissions operable multiple camps. So we only got one right now. Once a camp has been chosen, pick a unit from the roster to put them in position. Tanks can only be placed in spots with a tank icon, and infantry can only be deployed to unmarked spots. A CP symbol is displayed beside the name of some units on their profile window. These units are known as leaders. By including them on the field, they'll each add one CP to your total, allowing you to control more units per turn. Deploy more leaders to gain more CP. Intel has reported a tank on the field. Deploying a Lancer here is recommended. Those are the guys, Lancers. So obviously Claude's in it. We gotta get Raz because we wanna get our CP points. And, and where's Kai? Because she's also a leader as well. So I'll put her up front. Uh, engineer, I don't think I need. We'll, get, we'll do our Lancers. Okay. We got one Lancer in. Get one Scout. Actually, you probably should get two scouts. Well, who's in? Millennia? I want to make sure we, uh, we put people who uh, are good together. So obviously, this guy here. Well, this girl likes Millennia, so I'll put her in. Uh, I'm going to put two scouts. I should have put an engineer. Nah, I'm gonna put a scout. I don't think we'll need an engineer just yet. Here? So I think that's it right now. We got six. So let's deploy. Now, capture that cannon. You ready? Take down the Imperial camp. Capture their heavy artillery. Squad E, move out! Uh, this brings back so many memories. I played the original one so long ago, and 
can't believe we're fighting playing a sequel. But they're tough nuts to crack. What should we do? We can't exactly rush in and kick the door down. We'll get routed if we don't have a plan. First, we need a solid foothold. Let's capture that camp. After that, well, guess we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Weapons free. Squad E, move out. All right, one step at a time. Pay attention, Claude. Your leadership skills are going to be put to the test. That means getting the most out of your soldiers. Don't forget the... Yeah, good point. I'll keep that in mind. Tutorial camps. Camps are set up across the battlefield. Units stationed near an allied camp receive a bonus to defense and HP recovery at the start of each turn. Occupying a camp allows you to call for reinforcements or have a unit retreat. Capture an enemy camp by defeating all the enemy units within it, then moving to their flag and pressing A. If there are no allies in your camp, the enemy can capture it from you. There are two kinds of camps, base camp and field camps. Capture the enemy base camp while defending your own to win. Expanding your squad's capabilities by capturing field camps early on will help pave the way to victory. Oh, we got a lot of CP points. All right, so we got a tank here. Uh, and a second tank there. Scouts. That's their uh, secondary camp. We got their main camp here. Okay. We got the gunners there. So I'm going to head out with a tank first and give covering fire. Because as, as we move closer, the tank's going to start shooting at us. Field actions. Press A when prompted. When a prompt appears near certain terrain to take special actions. What's this? Oh, grass, okay. Pressing A in tall grass lets you drop prone and crawl to hide from enemies. Climbing ladders to reach higher grounds is another common field action. Field action can only be taken when a prompt for A appears on the screen. No problem, no problem. Yeah, so we'll give our unit some cover here. Take the shot. I'm gonna just block him. Make sure I block his ass. Okay. Tutorial Lancers. The Lancer class uses anti tech weaponry. They have the defense and entry to maneuver behind tanks and hit their weak points. Lancers are also resistant to explosives and take less damage from mortars and grenades. The power is offset by the low AP and slow movement speed, so they're better suited to fighting tanks than recon or assault. Uh, let's go. We'll take our Lancer out. Potential. Oh crap. That's not good. Uh, let's go. Can I make it? I'll probably need to do two points. Crawl, you. God, I took some damage. Whatever you do, do it fast. Yeah, I'm gonna need uh, two. Make haste. Not a moment to lose. I gotta use two CP points for this. I don't. I, I won't be able to hit them from here. So okay, we'll use them again. Let's go. There he is, exposed. Can't use grenades with them this close. Can I shoot from crouch? I wonder. Give me a report on the enemy. Okay, here we go. Come on, have good accuracy. No, are you kidding me? Let's see how they like these mortars. You are kidding me. Oh man, I should have gotten closer. Um, I gotta use him. I gotta use him again. Magic makeup, HP recovery. Okay, let's get closer. Let's get real close. That way, we don't miss. Bye now. Bye bye now. Uh, let's go a little bit closer. 
Alright, um... Now we'll use our tank to move up a little bit more. Give her some cover. Sight lines. When a unit sees an enemy in action mode, a sight line will appear over their head. Sight lines point in the direction of a visible enemy's location and represent different things dependent on the color. Blue line, the enemy hasn't spotted you. Yellow line, the enemy has spotted you. Red line, the enemy is firing at you. Green line, the enemy is busy reloading. Use sight lines as a guide when attacking or when trying to position units into a spot where they'll be safe from attacks. Alright, they see me. They see me. Uh, where's the map? How do I do this? Let's get closer. Or should I go for the, uh, this guy here? Yeah, I'm gonna take him out. There you go! Uh, and who should I bring next? Who's there? An engineer? I'm gonna bring my scouts over and uh, try to cover some ground. Will they shoot me? Am I far enough? Yep, I'm good. Oh no! Oh shoot! Okay. Hopefully we can hit this guy. Here. Oh, shoot. No. Ah, he does garbage damage. Oh, shoot, gotta end it. He's gonna keep shooting at me. Got one more. Um, AP's low. Should I bring my scout? Now sure. I wonder if I could snipe them from here. Nope, that's not a good shot. We gotta go this way. If we can't advance, the whole operation I could probably shoot from here. Oh, I don't know. I didn't see them anymore. Oh, here we go. I can take that guy out. I can try. Might as well. There. <laughs> Headshot. Still not enough damage. All right. Let's end our phase. Come on, shoot back. Take him out. Yes. There's also hidden enemies as well. Nice. Take them out. Critical condition and HP recovery. Units whose HP falls to zero are in critical condi condition and cannot use CP to take actions. If a unit is taking heavy damage, try to keep them out of danger. Foot soldiers stationed near an allied camp get a boost to the amount of HP recovered at the start of each turn. Tanks do not recover lost HP unless they are near an allied camp. If a tank's HP reaches zero, it immediately retreats. Whoo, I got a lot of CP. Okay. Um, who do I want to bring over? I can probably go around. I'm going to see if I can snipe that guy. Oh, yeah. Snipe your ass easy. Should be accurate. Really oh my god. You're kidding me. Find the enemy's weak spot. Go here. You're choking me with that. The engineer class makes up for low combat prowess with unique abilities. Resupply, repair, and revive. In action mode, engineers can resupply an ally's ammo by moving close to them. 
He can also repair sandbags and ladders that have been destroyed by moving close and pressing A as a field action. Unlike normal Ragnade, Revival Ragnade can revive allies in critical condition. They can also use their vehicle repair kit to restore HP to vehicular, vehicular units. Revival Ragnade and the vehicle repair kit can both be used in target mode. Don't hesitate to use them when the need arises. Ragnade. Infantry automatically cover a small amount of HP each player phase, but sometimes they need immediate healing. Switch to Ragnade with uh, X, then press right back button and select the target. Place the crosshairs on a nearby ally to hear them, or place them on no one to heal the unit using the Ragnade. Okay, how much health does this guy have? Um, I'm gonna bring more scouts into here. I just wanna bring more people up. I should be able to make it around and take out that infantry guy. Okay, here we go. I just need two headshots or 11 shots of the body, but we'll go for two headshots. Need some help, Teresa? Yes, there you go. Target destroyed. Very good. I'm going to leave her there. And that engineer there is in cover, so I won't be able to get him. That easily, unless we have grenades. Shoot. Uh, I'm gonna go this way actually. And take out the guy there. The mortar. He's gonna be a big problem for my infantry. Go. Um, really yeah. this I'm gonna, oh no, come on. I can't break that? Don't lose focus. Ah, I can't break it. Okay. Um, there's no hidden enemies anywhere else? Okay. Maybe you shouldn't chase them in too far. Just want to make sure he doesn't move to take out. Let's see like, how they like these okay, should be good. All right, let's bring my lancer in. Woman, hear me roar. She hates men. That's not. That's not good. Can't see me. You can't see me. Let's get as close as possible. Get this person out. Bye now. Oh, I like that. Not bad out there. Are you tired? So I don't remember if the scouts have grenades or not. Um, let's try it out. I don't know if they have grenades. Oh, they do. Okay, okay. They do. That's something that they... Uh, There you go, grenades, okay. Enemies crouch behind sandbags to take significantly reduced damage. Grenades and other explosives can destroy the sandbags, leaving enemies without cover. Use grenades by entering target mode and pressing X to switch weapons. However, grenades come in limited supply. Weapons with limited ammo like grenades recover one use per player phase. Sandbags aren't the only destructible objects, so try blowing up or driving over anything that looks suspicious. Will you see me? I don't think so. I don't think you see me. No. Here you go. He's a present. Nice. Looks like we got this. Capture. Enemy camp captured. Retreating. No more than 10 foot soldiers can be deployed on a map at once. After that, you're unable to call for reinforcements. You can substitute out currently deployed units for reserve units. Retreat by moving a unit into an allied camp facing the flag and pressing A. 
You can also press Y in command mode to retreat while a unit is in the camp. This method does not cost you any CP. A unit outside of a camp can still be sent to the reserves by pressing Y and sending them to a forced uh, retreat. Forced retreats cost 1 CP as does deploying a unit from the reserves. Uh, I don't not, I'm not gonna retreat. But can I deploy more units? I wonder. Morale boost. Taking down an enemy or capturing an enemy camp can trigger a morale boost. Morale boosts grant a higher chance of activating potentials and dodging. The end when the unit takes another action. If the unit is under heavy fire, it may be wise to hold onto the morale boost by not taking any actions on that turn. Ooh, got morale boost. So I can deploy more people. Uh, I'm going to evacuate him. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, he wasn't at the camp. Oh, well. Uh, and I'm going to deploy him here. What? Is he here? He's not here? Okay. Oh, here he is. Okay. No. I can... I'm gonna go around. Ah, damn it. I screwed it up. Oh well, I probably could have ended it there, but I tried to do something else. Soldiers not currently deployed are waiting in the reserves. Reserve units can be deployed from ally camps as reinforcements. Select the camp in command mode and press A to display a list of available units. Once a call for backup has been sent, the unit will arrive on your next phase. Reinforcement requests will be cancelled if the camp is taken before the reserve unit can be deployed there. The enemy can likewise call for backup. The only way to stop this from happening is to capture the enemy's camp ASAP. Where is he going? He ain't going anywhere. He ain't going nowhere. Damn, they didn't... He doesn't arrive in the... The camp, uh... Campground, so... I have to waste one there. Alright, let's back up. God, okay. Oh my god. Stay low. Areas. What the heck? Why am I? Why is he turning? Just move back, move back. Let's use this mortar again. Fire. There you go. Easy. Oh, here is the CP point. Defeated leaders. When a leader is defeated, their CP is nullified. Their commander will receive fewer CP at the start of their phases. Both allies and enemies have leaders. Claude and Raz are leaders in Squad E. Keep your leader units protected while actively seeking out and destroying enemy leaders to reduce their CP pool. They might be soldiers after all. So I can't break that? I can't break this wood? Ah, I'm gonna move up because I don't know... There might This might be an extended mission. I might need to... Oh shoot. They damage her? Uh, let us move... Millennia. Uh, unfinished business. She's got uh, some boost going on. I think you get something if you touch them. No. Never mind. Hey, this. After this. Enemy camp captured. They're too well fortified. Even with the camp, we can't advance like this. This is bad, Claude. If this keeps up, they'll mow us down. Come on, let's just go all out and charge them. Better than sitting here and dying, right? No, a frontal assault is way too dangerous. We have to stand back. Easy for you to say. Damn, if only we had artillery. There has to be some way through. Just hang on until I find it. Victory condition has changed to any allied unit reaches the target. 
Oh, everyone's here. Uh, can't get tanks through there. I sniped the guy on there. Let's see if I can snipe him. Will that do something? But it's gonna take four shots though. It's a thing. Just hold out until I make it there. What can we do? What does he have? Okay. Let's just snipe him. I don't think I can destroy the actual turret, but let's see if we can shoot this person. The ruins should give you some cover. Uh, if we s oh, we can't send the tank over. Is there any hidden routes that we can take? The bridge. Let's just move the tank and see what Moving happens. Out. Can I break this? Do not betray my confidence in you, squad e. All right, cannot enter. All right, one to kill. No, nope, mortar can't reach there. Okay, if we use this AP rounds, we might be able to do something. I can't see him, so. Let's try these AP rounds. It's such a wide circle though, I don't I don't know if I can hit him. Right there. Oh, I totally missed. Oh well. Okay. How do I get through? Enemies everywhere. What are we supposed to do, damn it? <laughs> Looks like you're in a tight spot, Cinderella. Wait, Cinder, what now? This sure as hell ain't a fairy tale! I'm up to get to the ball at the castle, but I don't even have a pumpkin, let alone a carriage. Seriously? What's gotten into you, Cl <laughs> Well, I am no godmother, but I can work some magic for you. Magic, huh? We could use a little, if it was real. Reinforcements have arrived. Who's this? Oh, this is the new unit. The new class. Let's use this person. Grenadiers. The Grenadier class launches explosives from the mortars in an arc to reach enemies behind cover or on high ground. Grenadiers can intercept enemies behind cover as long as an ally can see them. Their interception fire also slows down the target's movements. Grenadiers pack a lot of firepower, but it takes time for them to set up, line up the shot, and then attack. They're vulnerable to attack while setting up their mortars, so be careful not to get them stuck in a position under heavy fire. Pack a mortar back up by pressing A. As a fire support unit, coordinating with more mobile classes is crucial. Sure. Can I... Can I get that guy? Oh, looks like I can. Here you go. Kind of ammo. Nope. Let's use that. To kill one shot. Oh my god, did I miss? Okay, let's put this away. I'm gonna leave her here. Uh, I gotta do a second shot. Alright, let's do a second shot with my grenadier. This should kill him for sure. There you go. We got one more shot left. Hold position. I'll head over for support. Can 
Okay. I might need an engineer, actually. Shoot. To resupply. You only got one shot left. All right, come on. Get this guy. Come on. Nice. Kill confirmed. Not bad out there. Okay, let's put this away. Oh no, the tank's in the way. Ah, crap. I'm gonna have to move the tank. Crap, okay, I just wasted. Let's see if I can get him with this. Let's see if I'm lucky. Am I lucky? Oh, wow, I'm lucky. I should have expected as much from you. Nice. Alright. Can't do anything from here. I'm gonna deploy a engineer. He has more HP, so I'll use him. She has more dodge, I don't know. I'll use her. Ooh, we got, got a lot of uh, machine gunners there. What's he doing? One left and right? Oh, nice, he can shoot, shoot. I didn't know they can do that. Nice. Trying to get close. What are you trying to do? Oh, wow. I always feel like that's a little cheap. Yay, reinforcements arrived. Uh, I'm gonna bring my engineer. Well, I'm gonna use her first. Because then she'll have zero ammo at the end of it. Surprise attack. Let's see. I guess because he doesn't see me. Yeah, get rid of that CP point. this away I don't think there's another guy up there so watch out for anti tank weapon uh, I'm not gonna get too close I'm gonna go here oh, there's a gunner up there I need ammo now stay here Um, and I don't know if there is any more sandbags there, but whatever. I'll bring my engineer over. Take some ammo. Let's see how they like these mortars. Give you some ammo. Uh oh, the enemy is firing oh crap! Back. Uh, can I go there? Oh, there you go. Let's see how good you are. One shot! Oh, you only, he's low health. Suck it up. Yes! Our allies have been taken out. Let's go back and cover. Okay, no one's in the camp. And that's all we... Oh, we gotta get that. Uh, I'm gonna use my Grenadier again. To take out uh, the two guys on the end there. I can't jump over this. We're down. Crouch. Oh, those guys are done. Let's shoot. There. Will that take both of them out? Let's see. Take Nice. Target destroyed. Uh, 
SP. There we go. Can she make it there? I don't know. I'll let us move Teresa. Take Teresa over. We got one gunner left there. But I just want to take this. Uh... Will he be able to shoot me? I don't know. Let's see. Shoot. Well, let's see if I can shoot at him. Just to weaken him a bit. Nah, let's not do it. He might shoot back. Okay, Riley. Let's see if you can. This one's a Riley Miller special. Nice ammo recovery. Let's put this away. Bolt over. Bolt over, please. We can't afford to drag our feet here. Let me take you out first. Take this guy. Come on. Nice and easy. Got him. Our allies have hey, capture. Enemy base capture. Nice. We've captured an enemy. Uh, and do we just walk on through? What? Moving out. Let's see. There you go! Nice. That would suck if I only just made behind right. the line. We broke through. Keep advancing. Capture that cannon. Federation bastards. We won't let the blood, sweat, and tears of the Imperial people fall into your hands. <sighs> Glory to the motherland! Everyone, get down! Oh, they blew it up. Well, that sucks. They blew it up. Oh, A rank. I feel like I did good this mission. New episode has been added. You certainly impressed someone in that last battle. HQ sent you something nice as a reward. Tutorial awards. Awards are granted for fulfilling certain requirements in combat. These include weapons and accessories. Each battle offers a different award. Unlike items obtained from R&D, awards and spoils received are limited in number. You can only equip as many as you have. Show cap. I'll have to check that out later. Your soldier's preferences have changed. Alright, nice.